your career at Stanford? Yeah. How's it feel? Feels great. Um, I feel like this whole year has just been kind of a huge step forward for me. Um, couldn't have asked for a better end of my Stanford career. Not sure if I'll be racing one more time in the singlet at USA's, but for right now I'm definitely enjoying the moment. And I definitely took every step in on that track with Vanessa, and I know that we have a lot of work left to do here on the Stanford front for years to come, so I'm just so excited in general. Were you, were you nervous having the fastest ever qualifying time coming into the championships? Um, I mean, yes and no. I mean, at some point, like, that time doesn't really matter. I ran it at Peyton, and I under, I go into Peyton every year knowing that it's, like, a perfect setup to run really fast. And I'm in a field of colle uh, post-collegiates and pros, and they're just kind of pulling me along. So, yes, it's a 5'8 team, but I came in here knowing that, I mean, I'm... Emily Sisson and I've got Emma Bates and Dom Scott and like all these girls who are just like I mean they just run wire to wire in every race so I was just stoked to be on the line with them. You've had such a good indoor and outdoor season. Yeah. What's what's the biggest change? What's how how does it happen? Um, I think you know I just grew up and I got out of my own head, which takes five years unfortunately for me. But um, I think this year it's like I've had such a blast at Stanford, but this year it's just been a lot about. You know, you get halfway through your year and you're like, hey, this is my last blank and my last blank. So I, I just enjoyed every moment and had the best teammates and best coaches. So I, I don't, I just think everything came together this year for me and it worked out. <laughs> What's next? Um, no idea. Graduation tomorrow, and that's all I know. But um, as for right now, definitely, um, you know, putting a good, solid two block, uh, two week blocks worth of uh, work left on the track at Stanford, uh, preparing for USA's. Um, you know, just training a, a few hard uh, more weeks, and then um, enjoying graduation. And then after that, not sure, but right now I'm just enjoying life and I'm surprised I'm not more emotional. I think I did all my crying last week at our banquet and everything, but I'm just so, I'm super stoked for the squad and for the results we had today. Are you going to try to continue to keep running next year? or? I would love to. Yeah, that's definitely the plan. Um, I haven't really thought much about it at all, actually, this year, so I'm probably going to figure that out in the next few weeks and maybe even take as long as I need to over the summer now that I have all this time on my hands. But, um, yeah. Yeah, I'd love to keep running. Being from Arizona and then living in California, do you think it would be hard to leave the West Coast if you um, had to? You know, I'm, I'm open to anything for sure. I, I mean, I love, I feel like, you know, co with Coach Mill and Coach Liz and everything at Stanford, I feel like it's, it's a, to some extent I'm like, why change anything? But obviously I'm going to be open to opportunities and I'm just super stoked to see what's out there for me. But I love Stanford, so we'll see what happens. Definitely have an open mind, though. Congratulations. <laughs> Thanks so much. <laughs> do you think you could, um, after USA's, are you going to try to go to Europe and keep running, or are you pretty tired? Um, not tired at all. I think it kind of just depends how things unfold. I'm definitely open to competing throughout the summer, but I think I'm just, at this point, going to take it week-by-week -week basis, and then after USA's, really figure out what's going on. But um, right now, I'm just going to soak in this experience, and then graduate in the morning, and then focus on USA's, and then probably figure everything out after that. So, like, you got graduation tomorrow, so, like, is your family here, or are they waiting for your graduation? How does that they're work? They're here, and then they're flying to uh, San Francisco, and then watching me walk. I, they're troopers, and my brother flew out for my first collegiate <laughs> race, which is very cool. Um, so I've got everybody here, and yeah, I'll see them back at home. But yeah, it was great to have them out. Okay, great. Thank you.